trade number 24. Okay then, so that solidifies trade number 24. You can see the updated balance. 1737.75. Um, so we are well above the $1,600 level now. So um, upon the next trade, we'll be scaling up to the 16 contract level. So today marks... Um, the fourth flip. So that's now from 800 to 1600. And basically from 100 to 1600 within, I don't even know exactly how many days. So today's June 12th. Um, I believe, I believe that the first trade was taken on May 12th. Hang on. Okay. So I pulled up trade number one. Let's take a look and see what, what date. I think it was May 12th. It is May 12th. Right there. Right there, you can see it, May 12th. Okay, so the first trade taken on May 12th, today being June 12th. So that represents 30 days. Yeah, that's 30, I think it's 30 days or 31 days. Let me, let me pull out the calendar now. <laughs> I just want to make sure that I'm politically correct. <clears throat> okay, so today's June 12th. So we go back to the 5th, the 29th of May so that's the fifth that's seven um, so the twelfth is over here so if we go back that's seven fourteen twenty one twenty eight twenty nine thirty thirty one so it's actually thirty one days yeah, I just wanted to be, I wanted to get the exact number. So that's 31 days. Okay. So from 100 to, to 1,631 days. That's where we are now. And this represents the fourth flip within the project. You know, once again, skill, patience, discipline, and just execution repeatedly. Not being scared to take the trade when the market presents the opportunities. Knowing what to anticipate from the market when observing behavior and environment in the market. And having full confidence in my ability to basically do all of the above. Full confidence in the skill. What is that all equal? The ability to flip. This is flip number four. So altogether, 31 days from 100 to 1600. Um, I believe that the last flip to 800 was on June 6th. 
I believe that was June 6th. And from June 6th to June 12th is six days. So from 800 to 1600 was six days. Yeah, six days. And I actually want to verify that. Hang on a second. Okay, so let's see if I'm correct. This is the trade right here that represented to 800. Let me go to the end. Let me go to the end of the trade, which was here. Okay, there's the trade. And then the updated balance. So 873.75. And that was on June 6th. Okay. So June 6th. So from June 6th to June 12th. Six days. Flipped 800 to 1600. So you can see like during the, 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 the period of time for each flip, there were various amounts of time. I think the first flip was five days. Then the second one was like 12 days. Then the, the third one, I don't know. I don't even remember. And then this one is six days. So various amounts of time that it took just patiently waiting for the market to present the opportunities when they come and then giving maximum value to the trades that I'm taking. See, that's where scaling up the contract size and not being afraid to do that comes in. Being fearful is not on, it's not part of the equation. Let me just put it like that. We're not scared. You can't be scared. You have to be confident in your, in your skill and you have to develop skill to the point where you have the confidence. Like they are one and the same. They go hand in hand. So you can't be scared and you have to be prepared to pull the trigger when the trades come. And at the same time, you have to know how to interpret the market so you know to stay out when the time is not right. How do we do all of this? Training. Bottom line, or you know, it always reverts back to training every single time. It's never going to change. It's always going to be the case because training is the only thing that conditions you to be this effective in the market, period. Period. All right, so we're going to wrap it up. Mark Fuller, Team Alliance, Blueprint Project. This represents trade number 24. Um, so we have flipped up to the $1,600 level. We actually are at 1737 75 That's the exact balance. And um, that represents basically 100 to 1631 days. Uh, you stay tuned. More to come for the project. Mark Fuller, Team Alliance. Peace.